How do we please God? My friend, I believe that it is in giving back. In in not just accepting the gifts of God, but in giving away freely. One of the best ways to do this is by prayerfully considering to give to PositiveChristianity.org. Twice a year we come to you and we ask you to remember us in your giving. If you've never given to us before, this is the time, and small gifts make a huge difference. This is the time that we're coming to year's end. So for credit on this year's giving, I ask you to consider giving to Positive Christianity. Here's what it says in 2 Peter 1 verse 3. Everything that goes into a life of pleasing God has been miraculously given to us by getting to know personally and intimately the one who invited us to God the best invitation that we have ever received. When God created you, God equipped you with an assortment of talents an assortment of abilities that are uniquely yours. It's up to you to develop these. This is the whole reason we're here, is to daily remind you to develop your God-given abilities and to use them in the unique way that God created you, you uniquely to do so. But we also remind you that at times society will tempt to pigeonhole you, to standardize you, to make you fit into a preformed mold. And at times, because we are all imperfect human beings, we may be so wrapped up in meeting society's expectations that we fail to focus on God's expectations. But what God has in store for you, my friend, is so infinitely better than any other alternative. Whom will you try to please today? God or society? Your primary goal should always be not to try to please imperfect women and men, but to reach your full potential. Strive diligently to please your all-knowing and gracious God. Attempt in every day of your life to give back more than you receive. You'll discover what I discovered years ago. It is absolutely impossible to outgive God. God bless you, my friend. And I want to take a moment to thank all those that have already considered giving to PositiveChristianity.org in the past, that have made this ministry possible for so many all around the world of every faith. That's what makes us unique and different. And for those that have never considered it, I pray with you that you consider giving a little bit to PositiveChristianity.org to make a big difference. God bless you.